Hello guys, welcome back to Super Hang On Sunday, me Lutin. Let's crack on. Now then, some of you may have attended this week my attempt at a Super Hang On stream. It, uh, it ended poorly, mainly because... Uh, bah, bah, come on. It ended bad because uh, I just couldn't get it to work right. Seriously, the stream quality was bad. Oh, mother of Christ. Bad start today. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's actually late, by the way. It's not. It's my normal time for recording this. I actually feel pretty good. As you can probably tell, I sound a bit more weak than my dead one last time around. Let's see what we can do here. I don't know why I'm so perky. Uh, who knows? Anyway. Maybe I've gone through the wall, you know, I've gone through the barrier of tiredness and like, I'm all good now. I'm flying, you know, I'm hovering. But um, anyway, yeah, the stream didn't go so good. Mainly just because yeah, streaming seems to be very finicky, you know. And I was trying to do it through the Elgato. Uh, it just was not enjoying it. The quality was just, I had to drop the quality a bit because I was trying to preserve uh, the sort of stream rate for people. Trying to get some good quality there. It was just not having it. Um, my actual internet connection is generally on the whole pretty damn good. Um, it was just, I don't know, it was some technical difficulty, couldn't figure it out. Uh, the options for what you can actually, well, slow down, wait, well, <laughs> over anticipated how much break I needed there. Um, also, something else, right? I have occasionally done marathon sessions on here, on YouTube, for this game. Well, you know, people can kind of. Whoa, did you see that? What a. That was a little pro tip for you there. If you fly off the track. Don't. Oh. Why does this always happen? Why, when I'm going like, hey, yeah, if you want to be really awesome at this game, and then in the process of explaining that, I crash off the track. Oh, this was a wipeout. Wipeout. Anyway. I made null. What, what's that guy doing there? What's that yellow biker doing right there? Look. He's like 180. <laughs> oh, good times. Okay. So yeah, in essence, yeah, it didn't go good, just because the quality was just not right. I just couldn't get it, and um, the, the Elgato has limited uh, sort of setting options, as opposed to something like OBS or uh, XSplit, which gives you a lot better options. Um, so I kind of blame it in part on that. Uh, but, you know, the, El the Elgato is still a great device. Don't knock it just for that, you know. Um, it, it's maybe not the most 100% thing for streaming, it's got to be said, but um, it could have just been that one day, I don't know. Uh, so, yeah, I'm not going to give up fully on it, but I think I need to do some more testing there and sort of see what the deal is. Um, but for sure, on the day... Oh! Oh! Oh my god, we survived. Okay. What? what did you see that guy? Cheap ass. hate these enemy bikers. Anyway, but despite this, I, I, I really wanted to try and rip um, one race that I had, but I couldn't in the end. Uh, and when I watched it back, the stream quality was just um, it was just not good enough. It really was just not good enough. Sometimes it was freezing, sometimes it was just not right, and uh, uh, all in all, it was just not so good. Um, which is a shame, because on one of my race laps, uh, I actually managed to get, again, one step away Oh, damn it! One step away from completing this game. Uh, well, this stage anyway. Uh, I was one. Oh, come on now! What's going on today? Well, <laughs> just what's going on every single time. We oh, oh my god! I'm freaking out today. It's just what happens every time we play this game. Of course, I'm getting screwed over by bikers. Um, but th that's probably bad to take that out of context. But uh, uh, um, something else as well. <laughs> <laughs> My girlfriend said to me while we were watching the stream, and she was like, uh, she was like, doing all these races one after another is boring. And I was like, hey, don't say that. <laughs> She's supportive of me, but uh, she was right, it was boring. So <laughs> I decided that doing a extended uh, stream of just me doing these races is not as enjoyable as some of my other stream options that I have. So I, I think for that reason as well. Um, at least until I could figure out a way... Oh, I thought I was going to do that much better. Um, until I can actually sort of pin down the quality aspect of it. It's just maybe one to sort of put on hold for now. Uh, streaming seems to go a lot better when I do it from the PC. Oh, so it's all good. Anyway, what else is going on with me? This my... Ah, come on now. What race are we even on? Is this two? I'm going to say this is two. Do do do... 
Um, what else is going on with me? Last of Us is nearly completed. I forgot to post Far Cry this week. Ah, there was stuff, stuff going on, you know, stuff going on. Eurogamer is approaching. Uh, that's going to be coming pretty soon. I love how, like, Eurogamer is in London and yet Gamescom is in Germany. For some reason, I kind of feel like those names should be reversed. Eurogamer seems more apt for... I, I don't know why. I'm just saying, I mean, you, you know, UK is in Europe as well, but it just seems more kind of fitting for both. But anyway, there we go. Um, Eurogamer, I will be there if you want to come along. Great to see you. Um, on Thursday, I'm going to be there probably with less producers. I think Friday, there's going to be more uh, producers around. So Thursday, I'm going to be at Eurogamer all day. So if you happen to be there and would like to come and say hello, then just, you know, let me know. That'd be great to sort of see some people. But as I say, out of the 100 people that will watch this video, I'd be surprised if any of you guys were going. Uh, but I will probably advertise it on the main channel as well. Not the main channel, blah, blah, blah. I should just give up on my... Try not to call it the main channel. It is the main channel. So, well, for now, who knows? You know, this channel, it could explode in thousands of numbers. <laughs> yeah, it's quite unlikely. But anyway, um, we are ever moving on as they with <clears throat> completing uh, other series at the moment so that's great news more things to come on that um uh, i was hoping to perhaps oh i'm, I'm starting to think about my, what i'm talking about rather than the game um defcon now i i kind of i don't know why i posted it on my primary channel i think it's because it was kind of like quite interesting and sort of a war game you know so I was like yeah this will go on the main channel um, and then and by the way we're in the beach level well, hey. um, and then it ended up sort of doing a little bit better than I thought like people kind of seem to quite like the fact that it's a bit different uh, it actually seemed like a game that I was going to post here on looting gaming uh, but actually it seems like now I may run that on the main channel so if you missed that if you didn't see defcon or you didn't see my stream of defcon go check it out because it's a really cool game um i am going to want to do some uh whoa see that little side sweep there i'm going to want to do some more sort of live stream stuff for that civilization uh civilization as well if you haven't seen that on the stream by the way if you guys uh, if if some of you are watching this and you oh how do we avoid those trees if you guys are watching this on this channel and you're not on my stream you really should because you guys seem like the kind of people that would want to watch me stream more so than perhaps people from the main channel. We got into orange, guys. We're in orange. We're in... Come on! Oh, I thought for half a second we had a, an opportunity to run through on that. How many have we got left to run? Two? We've got two runs left, maybe. Probably only one, but I'm imagining in my mind two. We got to orange. We got to orange with me crashing and being crap. Awesome. Let's bring it on. Ba 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 da ba da ba da ba da 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 Awesome stuff. I had a really good idea. Oh, I've had. Whoa, not. Oh, damn it. Lost all my speed. God damn it, Lutin. Thinking about other things. Uh, anyway. I don't know why I keep imagining, but I, do you know, actually, I think it's, it's a good goal to sort of think about, like, other things that I want to do after this. That's probably why, I, whenever I do this series, I'm always thinking about, like, what I want to do after I complete this. Because in my mind, like, <laughs> I'm just like, I will complete this one day. I will do it one day. I will. But I'm getting ever more excited for Battle for 4. You know, I'm kind of at that period now where I'm kind of like, I'm just ready for Battle for 4. You know, I'm, I'm kind of like, I've done all my sort of thinking about it already. It's like... You know, I don't want to be breaking down every minute aspect of tiny, you know, like the table scraps of information that we have coming now. You know, they gave us so much information at Gamescom, kind of like, right, I'm ready now. I'm ready for it. You've told us all about it. I'm ready for the game. So I'm really excited for the beta, uh, which is obviously coming uh, at the beginning of October, I believe. So that'll be exciting. Whoa, that could have progressively gone worse. We did all right now. Do, do. do you know, I'm feeling a little bit more comfortable with this game. That, that might seem difficult to believe. But um, I, I am just kind of... You might you might notice I'm generally doing a lot better. <coughs> you take that with a pinch of salt. But I, I am doing a little bit better. I'm generally, overall, getting to the later stages much more consistently. Um, and I'm finding that I can kind of... When it's not totally screwing me over, I'm kind of generally 
handling between bikers a little bit better than I would have done previously, which is a really good sign. Um, I think it, I am actually making some mild progress with this game. It's a shame there's not some N64... What was that N64 game? There was a great N64 game, like biker game. What the hell was that game called? G something? G something, I think. It was a real good uh, sort of speed game. Uh, it was like you, your your bikes were. It was kind of like the kind of N64 version of Wipeout, but with kind of like light cycles. It was really cool. So you guys will remember definitely. Oh, it was called G something. Damned if I can remember though. But anyway, it was a real good game. It was real fast. I loved the way the bikes worked and stuff. I mean, if I could, ooh, I might I might try and. Uh, I, I I've got my N64 at home. Um, God knows whether I could actually hook it up to actually any recording device. Oh, actually, I should be able to record it up to the... Oh, damn. I should be able to record it to the Elgato, actually, because I have got the kind of retro uh, plugs for that. No! Oh, you mother... Flipping people. You flipping flippers. Uh, request from you guys. Uh, if you have never seen before, I have a third kind of semi-secret channel, not secret, but just nobody subscribed, <laughs> called uh, LT Script, and it's my channel for books, script, literature, and so on. It's a hugely undeveloped channel. Uh, I haven't really sort of done a ton with it yet, but I, I'm kind of intending to. Probably not in the same kind of level as I do with this channel. Um, it'll probably be more along the lines of a post once a month or something along those lines. Um, but if you, uh, oh god damn, how does this happen sometimes? I, I sometimes feel like I kind of just watch myself do. Th this sounds stupid, but like uh, you know, I, I, you kind of just watch something happening, but you kind of feel like you're out of control of it. It's weird. Anyway, um, yeah, I have mentioned it previously on these uh, videos, but yeah, go and check it out. Um, I'll put the notes, uh, put the link in the notes so you can go and have a little look-see. I think I'm starting to sound more tired now because I'm going back to my kind of rambling, nonsensical stage. Can we even get through this beach checkpoint after all the chaos? No, probably not. Three, two, no, it's not going to happen. Bollocks. Uh. Anyway, what I was going to say was, if you guys have any suggestions for short stories, or it could even be, like, just written prose. Like, I remember there was some... Um, there were some magazines I used to have which would have kind of extracts and things like that. Anything along those lines. I would kind of be interested to have on there because uh, that's really what it's about. It's just kind of... Uh, some of it's going to be me reading stuff. Some of it's going to be reviews and things like that. Uh, but we haven't kind of got to that point yet. Uh, there is a couple of books I've got to review. So that will be going on there. But I'd say if you kind of enjoy my kind of uh, thoughts about things, then you might enjoy this. So go check it out. All right, let's get into this. Last one today. Come on, let's push the envelope. Whatever the hell. What does that mean? It's a bizarre turn of phrase. Somebody's going to look that up for me, no doubt. Oh, come on, no! <gasps> that was exactly what I was talking about. I saw that I was like a mil over. I was like one millimeter over. I was like, I'm going to hit that lamppost. And then I did. God damn it. Oh, oh, okay, right, bollocks. <laughs> Look where my bike is. Sorry, I'm sorry, I can't, I can't handle it, guys. I have to uh, veto, sorry. Just, it's... I'm not doing a whole run where I have two stupid crashes right at the beginning. Right, this time. Uh, yeah, by the way, new, new rule at this stage. <laughs> Vetoes, I get one veto. One, and that's a set rule. Like it's even worth having rules the amount of time. One more round, I'll have one more go. I'm the worst for that, honestly, I swear. Anybody that watches this stream, anybody that plays play, anybody that plays Battlefield with me, God, I'm the worst on Battlefield. I'll be like, right, this is it, last round for me, guys, last round. Then it'll be like a fun round or something cool will happen. Okay, one more round, one more, <laughs> and then like the same, and it just goes on. Usually when I say to people, like, one more round, it usually means there's at least a minimum of hours, an extra hour of gameplay from that point. <laughs> Always with me. Okay, here we go, here we go. It's actually going pretty good. 
If I ever actually do this, you're going to get a, like, a World of Warcraft um, sort of volume scream from me. That was one of the best things about that game. And people often say to me, like, what was my best game ever? It's still going to be World of Warcraft, guaranteed. I mean, yeah, I got sick of it. Yeah, it's been around for a while and it's been kind of flogged to death now. Uh, does it still mean that it's not one of the best games I've ever played? No. It's, it's by far, far and away still one of the very best games I've ever played. Just for the sheer community level, the, the friends and the people and the experiences and the things that I remember back to doing and like the whole thing was like some saga for me in gaming. Like I played nothing else while I was playing WoW. Literally, I, I mean, I would occasionally maybe jump on the PS2 and like, you know, thrash out some Grand Theft Auto or something like that and I'd play a few little bits and pieces like that. Like, oh, balls to it. I had my GameCube as well, so I had some GameCube times, but um, you know, all in all, when I was playing WoW for like the four or five years that I played it, it was all about WoW. That was like the only thing that I could do. It was real awesome. I wish, um, because it's been years since I've spoken to a lot of people I used to play with, and some of them I probably wouldn't even be able to have any means of contacting them anymore, which is a shame because it would be wonderful to kind of get some of those guys that I used to play with like every single day for years and just, you know, have a big sort of forum and just discuss and remember and, you know, you guys could, you know, then share in sort of listening to some of those stories. And I can tell them, you know, I can tell you the stories and things that happened, but it would be so much better to kind of have other people on board. There's one or two people that I could potentially sort of get hold of to kind of get involved, but um, it's all sort of, you know, a bit speculative. But um, it would be wonderful. But yeah, the, the whole kind of cheering thing, you don't get any experience like that anywhere else, or well, you may in some games, but not from my perspective or point of view. Um, it was like in WoW, you have like these big raid bosses where you have uh, a huge group of players, like between it used to be 40, but it's more likely to be 20 now, I believe. Um, and you basically go to a kind of an instance or dungeon, and oh, I knew that was. Uh, do you know? Do you remember the last time we had the exact same cactus? Um, Unless you're really on the ball, you may not remember, but that exact same thing happened to me on that exact same rise. So I think we need to take note of that sort of chicane rise that it was the exact same deal. I came around on the inside, bike is in the middle, and I couldn't sort of um, get in on them because they're right there. And so they pushed me out over to the edge, and that's when I hit that cactus. Come on, come on. I can still do something good here. Come on. Three. That's not good. It's not good to be on three there. We negotiated those guys pretty well, though. Um, and yeah, so basically, like, you would often spend weeks, if you're on a very tricky boss, trying to deal with it and take it down. And it was exactly the same as, like, with this game, but just with 20 or 30 or 40 people all trying to complete it at the same time as a big team effort. And when you took it down, my God, those people were shouting. It was a big deal. You know, really, it was just everybody just screaming oh my god you know it was just an amazing experience I loved it wow I, I could talk for a long time about it oh come on man I really wanted to get through to orange again and maybe a bit further on this one I'm going out the window out of the window anyway do you know despite that I actually feel I still feel pretty good uh, today on this one uh, I think definitely didn't do. I, I kind of want another go. I, look, I'm doing it again. Ugh, blah blah blah. I didn't do today justice for my level of like sharpness. Maybe I should do one more run. No, I can't. I can't do another run, even though I totally could. But I can't because it'd be breaking the rules just too far, and I'd be making a mockery of myself, saying that I will only do one more run. So I'm not. Even though I badly want to, I'm going to draw a line under this episode today and say no more. <laughs> Next week, more super hang on. Thanks for watching today, guys. Be sure to check me out on Twitch TV for the stream. Be sure to uh, check out some of my other playthroughs this week. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.